Hello, I'm Jason Solomons, and if you've flown with Virgin Atlantic before, you'll know that means I'm here to tell you about the brilliant new movies we've got for you making their premiere on board this December. All crackers, no turkeys, I assure you. Café Society is the 47th feature by Woody Allen, a gorgeous period piece covering all his major themes, from unrequited love to Hollywood movies, gangsters, neurotic Jewish men and beautiful women. Jesse Eisenberg and Kristen Stewart are among the stars. You're very sweet. Have you heard that before? You have this deer in the headlights quality. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hunt for the Wilder People is the biggest indie film ever from New Zealand. A grumpy charmer of a comedy starring Sam Neill as an old loner, making friends with a gobby kid from the city, played by Julian Dennison. $10,000 to anyone who can capture them, dead or alive. Back up, homies! Oh, alive. They should be alive. Matt Damon hasn't forgotten he's Jason Bourne as the amnesiac CIA killer goes on the run once more, still trying to work out who he is and why things have a habit of blowing up when he's around. You're never going to find any peace. Not till you admit to yourself who you really are. Kubo and the Two Strings is a wondrous animation from the people who brought you Coraline, this time set in ancient Japan, where a little boy joins forces with Monkey and Beetle to harness his magic powers and save his family. Claim your birthright, Kubo. Do you dare watch or play? In Nerve, Emma Roberts takes the risk and plays the online gaming craze and finds herself mixed up with charming Dave Franco in a cyber world where nothing is what it seems, not even a kiss. V, hey, we control your life. The only way out is to win. Pete's Dragon is a welcome return for a Disney classic from my childhood. Yes, kids, they had films then about an orphan and his mate, the dragon named Elliot, this time starring Robert Redford, Bryce Dallas Howard and Oakes Fegley. What's a dragon? Shh. <gasps> That's a dragon. Captain Fantastic goes wild as Vigo Mortensen raises his super smart family in the woods but meets problems when it's time to enter the real world. Is he super dad or a criminal? War Dogs is brash, bold and based on a true story of two American chancers who become millionaire arms dealers. Miles Teller and Jonah Hill go all guns blazing until the fire gets unfriendly. No, no. My name is David Packhouse. I'm 22 years old and I'm an international arms dealer. Suicide Squad is the madcap super baddie movie with villains coming out of jail to do good or bad. Who can tell? Margot Robbie certainly doesn't care. Seriously, the hell's wrong with you people? We're bad guys. It's what we do. Meryl Streep is hilarious and heartbreaking as Florence Foster Jenkins, the world's worst and most deluded opera singer, aided by her dependable husband, Sinclair Bayfield, played by a resurgent Hugh Grant. She's remarkable, isn't she? She can be a little flat. Flat? It defies medical science. Morgan is a British sci-fi which stars Kate Mara investigating strange behaviour among human hybrids created by a shady tech company. A kind of robot wars gone mad. I wouldn't mess with Morgan. Show me! Show me how you feel! And Brotherhood sees Noel Clark return to the series he began with Kid Althood. His Sam Peel may be now older, a bit wiser and way too tired to get involved with London's gangs again, but he finds it impossible to resist when his young family comes under threat. Oh, you didn't want any trouble. I changed my mind. So those are just the main films making their bow on board in December. A mouth-watering selection, I know you'll agree.
But we've got more world cinema, documentaries, TV shows, comedies, kids stuff, games, live news and sports, music and destination guides which give you the lowdown on the highlights of where you're headed. Don't miss what's on Vera when you get on board. That's our entertainment highlight show where, with clips, reviews and interviews, I shine a light on my favourite picks and lesser-known gems among the selection because we wouldn't want you to miss out on any good bits. So pack your bags, change your voice message and tell everyone you're off to enjoy the finest entertainment in the skies with Virgin Atlantic. I hope to see you up there soon. Goodbye. Thank you.